Good afternoon. As you can see, I'm sitting in my home office rather than the auditorium at the campus with you in your cap and gowns, your parents and family, other family members and friends behind you. And I stand at the podium and confer your degree. You walk across the stage. Unfortunately, this isn't going to happen, but that doesn't mean your graduation is any less important. At two o'clock this afternoon, Dr. Eric Barron, our president of Penn State University, will stand and confer your degree. And at three o'clock, we'll have a celebration, which we hope you and your family and friends will join. I remember my graduation day, and I think despite the difference of how your graduation is this year, I want you to have your moment in time and have a special memory. The celebration of all that hard work that you have done in order to graduate with your diploma. I remember my graduation. It's several years ago. It happened at Beaver Stadium at that time. That's where all the graduates went. It was impersonal to some degree. Uh, I didn't walk the stage. My name wasn't announced. Uh, but at the end of this, this ceremony, we walked out into the field at Beaver Stadium, stood in line, and when I to get our diploma. When I got my diploma, something happened to me that I really wasn't expecting. I opened up the folder and saw that diploma and I started to get very emotional and started to cry. It was just like, oh my gosh, I have done this. And it was like being in a movie where the camera is on you and everything around you is blurred and you have your moment in time. So I ask you to take that moment in time and savor it. In another week or so, you will be getting that actual diploma. Open that folder and remember all of the, the hard work and what you have accomplished. Take all that you've learned and the future is in front of you for everything that you hope to happen in your life and in your career. Congratulations again to all of you. And I look forward to seeing you at our celebration at 3 p.m.